What if a virtual reality program could teach learners valuable communication and leadership skills, how to listen, how to manage frustration, develop self-awareness, recognize bias, produce empathy? In 2021, JFF Labs and SAP partnered to launch Skill Immersion Lab and connect learners ages 14 to 24 with virtual reality experiences, where they interact with virtual humans who react to them with lifelike mannerisms, facial expressions, and dialogue. These interactions take place in real-world situations that challenge learners to build upon and strengthen their communication and leadership skills. VR can be a powerful digital teaching and learning tool designed to help learners practice fundamental communication and interpersonal skills. Hi, I'm Michelle Gonzalez, JAG educator at Coolidge High School in Arizona. I'll share some of my experiences with bringing VR into my classroom. For each interaction, students react with one of three verbal options, each of which elicits a different response from the VR human. These can be positive, negative, or neutral. Based on this reaction, students are given a score, followed by a lesson that teaches them how to strengthen their skills, which leads to a final assessment of the skills they are practicing. Going in, students are free to retake the module as many times as they need with the pre-test score in place to show their growth. I told them, think of it as a fail-proof environment. The goal is to give them a space to practice the necessary communication skills that will prepare them for the next phase of their lives. Immersive learning is at its best when learners use the virtual world to try new things, make mistakes, and engage with their learning in a way that may not be possible in the real world. And by bringing VR technology into classrooms and programs across the country, Skill Immersion Labs gives learners the confidence to communicate in ways that will help them as they navigate their educational and career path. Like technology, the power of young learners is limitless. I like the though. I really like, I enjoy the Oculus. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I really enjoy like. Every time they pulled them out and told us to get them, I was the first one getting learned. <laughs> I wanted to see would I be able to get better, you know, from it. It felt good because, you know, sometimes when you do stuff, you get just um, scourged about it because you don't know if you could do it or not. And with me doing again, making a team, you know, it made me kind of happy about it. Different since, like, um, it's AI. If you mess up, you get a second chance. But if you're doing it in like um, real life, you don't get a second chance for anything. If you messed up, you messed up. Um, you will have to move on with it. But like with this AI program, like the virtual reality, you get to see what you do wrong and then fix on that. So you get a second chance over again. So it's better. I think it's a better learning experience. It makes me have to like really act like if I was in an actual workforce. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you gotta talk about something that you might not feel that comfortable. But I learned this thing that say sometimes you gotta be uncomfortable to be comfortable. Um, I guess I was really excited. VR headsets um, or something pretty cool. And then when we were, like when we learned we were gonna be able to like have real life experiences with them. It was kind of something like, you know, you can't see when you're, you know, 14, 15, 16, you don't see that like in your actual job because it's not like, if you have a part-time job, it's not professional like that. So it's nice to be able to see something that might prepare you for uh, future job skills. And um, I was just excited to learn about that. Kind of one of those things, if you're afraid of, you know, technology and now that's kind of ahead of what you're used to, then, kind of makes the future look scary you know you don't a lot of these kids feel like they're not moving fast enough already so to have them feel like they're incapable of figuring out something so modern i feel like that just all, all around breaks a barrier that okay i i'm more, i'm smarter than i think i'm more intelligent than i think i'm more capable than i think of that was a good realization that they had i learned that i could be a boss i, I can handle that at first I did and I was like, mm, I don't know. But as I, I finished the thing, then I the, like the last lesson where I had to talk to the boss, mm -hmm. the boss that really said it for me. Like, yeah, this is something I could do. I could be a, I could be a head boss. I could be a head of a company.